Hey everyone and welcome back to Hoffman Engineering. And today I am announcing the Cura plugin for 3dprintlog.com. If you weren't familiar with 3dprintlog.com, this is a website that I've been developing where you can create a free account to keep track of your 3D print details. You can track settings, filament usage, print times, and more. And today, I would like to announce a new Cura plugin to automatically upload print settings and all of those print information directly from Cura into 3D Print Log. And it's as easy as opening up the marketplace and scrolling down to community plugins and finding the 3D Print Log uploader. Clicking on that, you can install it directly into your Cura. And after it's installed and you restart Cura, what this allows you to do is after you've imported and sliced the prints, so for example, after we load in and slice this uh, 3D Benchy, we have all of the print settings, one hour, 17 minutes, we have filament usage, and we have all of the uh, print settings used for this. So after you've sliced your file and you're ready to save it, once you save the file, a dialog box will ask you if you would like to send it to 3dprintlog.com. If you click OK, it will open up 3dprintlog.com with that information. Now, if you aren't already logged in, you will be prompted to log in, or you can sign up for a new account if you haven't created one yet. But as soon as you log in, once you log in, you'll be sent directly to the Add a 3D Print page with all of the information already filled out. So you can see the estimated print time is 1 hour and 17 minutes. We have our filament usage in grams, and we have a summary of the print settings with the layer heights, top thicknesses, infill, whether we use supports, what kind of support detail. Um, all of that will be in the notes section. So I can go ahead and select that I'm about to start printing, and we can save that print and it gets added to your list of prints. And this Cura plugin does handle multi-extruder prints. So if you have a printer with dual extruders, uh, if you send over different settings, it will show you the different layer heights and print details for each of the separate extruders. The 3D Print Log plugin also adds a menu option under extensions for 3D Print Log, where you can also open up the web page with 3D Print Log directly from here. So you can click that, and you can see that I'm directly sent to the page to add a new 3D print. So thank you all for watching. Let me know what you think about the 3D print log uploader plugin for Cura. Uh, install it from the marketplace, try it out yourself, and create a free account to start logging your prints. If you have any feedback for me, if you have any suggestions or comments or something that you would like to see within 3D print log, uh, you can find a send feedback button in the menu where you can type in your feedback and give me your suggestions. I'm still under active development with this. We have tons of ideas coming from the community about things that they would like to see in 3D print logs. So if you have your own ideas, send them here and let me know what you think. And thank you all for watching this video. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you would like to keep up to date with the development of 3D print log or any of the other crazy projects I do on this channel. So thank you all for watching and I'll see you all next time.